Have you ever gotten really, really sleepy when you started to read your Bible or pray? I know that many have. Or I assume that many have. We have to know that it is a demon that is making people sleepy when they are trying to read the Bible and pray. It is a demon. It is not normal. For instance, when you watch TV, you can watch it even while tired for hours for many people. You can do so many things while tired, but when it comes down to reading the Bible or praying, within minutes you fall to sleep. Why is that? It is a demon or demons. Let me tell you about this one time. I was reading the Bible no, I was praying with this woman a while back, maybe a year ago, something like that. And when we started praying, it was so hard to stay awake. It was so crazy. And listen, I am not making anything up or anything like that because there is really no point to. And I was laying down while praying and it was so hard to keep my eyes open. And I had my laptop right in front of me while I was lying down. I saw this faintly. I saw this shadow like being right by my laptop that was by me. I don't know exactly what that thing was doing to me, but I believe that that shadow-like creature was the cause of me being really tired. So once I saw it, I commanded that demon to leave. Demon, leave now. Once that demon left, I woke up, as in, I was not feeling really tired anymore. We are in a spiritual war. There is a demon, there is a reason why demons don't want you to read the Bible and pray, because it is powerful. I am not saying that you have to read and pray for six hours every day. I am not saying that, but take some time to do it. Because if reading, if reading the Bible and praying was not so powerful or important, why are demons fighting you so badly when it comes down to those things? So obviously it is telling you it is beneficial for you to read the Bible and pray. So do it. Prayer does changes things by far. So I pray that this makes sense. God bless you.